This is a real quick <clears throat> review of the uh, Stealth Gear USA IWB for the uh, Smith & Wesson M&P Shield. I've been wearing this thing, oh man, I think over six months now. And uh, I, I just absolutely love it. We've worn it on four trips so far, 20 plus hours in the truck. I got no complaints. This thing is just absolutely comfortable to wear. It doesn't hold the body heat like the hard plastic ones. These little vent slots really dissipate the body heat. Even when I have gotten wet or, or sweaty, the gun had minimal, minimal sweat or, or moisture on it. It has really good retention. And uh, like I say, it, it's just a great buy. If you're in the market for an IWB, definitely give these guys a look. They make uh, quite a few models for uh, different models. You know, get the M&P shield here, but they, they make Glock and all kinds of other stuff. And uh, that little single stack magazine holder, it's been great. It's lightweight. It, it kind of stays back out of the way. It's comfortable. And... Uh, this uh, Bushnell 100 lumen pencil flashlight has uh, really been impressive. Like I say, I've worn this thing on roller coasters and water rides, and you can see where I've knocked the paint off of it. It's been beat and banged, rattled, soaking wet, and uh, works every time. I like the push button feature it has, and then you can lock it on if you need it. But uh, for 20 bucks. I would say this thing is a solid investment. So uh, this is just kind of a quick review of uh, my EDC. Like I said, I, I wear this with uh, basketball shorts on all the time and uh, no issues. So if you're in the market, man, give uh, Stealth Gear a, a good look. You can find them on, uh, I bought this one off Amazon, but uh, made in the USA. And I just absolutely love it. I'd buy another one in a heartbeat. So thanks for watching, everybody.